All right, Shalom. First and foremost, I'm going to give all praise, honor, and glory to Yahweh Hashem, Yahweh Shai. Yahweh is the Heavenly Father's true name, and Yahweh Shai is from the world ignorantly calls Jesus Christ. That's his true name. I'm also going to give double honors to the apostles and the elders, that great millstone for ruling and teaching on the scriptures, and salutations to all the Akim out there that push his word in all truth and in all sincerity. We'll do another GMS scripture of the day, and Lord willing, it's going to be entitled, Do Not Offend These Little Ones. Okay? And, um,. It's inspired by a video that I saw that the uh, apostle on the GMS Atlanta camp did on the former head, okay? The former head of uh, uh, GMS Atlanta. And um, he's a new display of what uh, not to be. He's a display of what a niggard uh, is, okay? And uh, we've had the, uh, the same situation or something sim similar. I'm not going to say the same situation. But we've had uh, a similar situation uh, out here in Chicago too, uh, with the uh, uh, with the few members, okay, they used to be in GMS. All right, uh, they're uh, um, the camp ITR now. All right, you know they got kicked out about three years ago, roughly, and you know they they were doing a bunch of niggard stuff, you know as well, okay, and um, that's something that you know we're not supposed to be doing in this truth. We're supposed to be brothers, okay, and you don't want to offend. One of Yahweh Bashim Yahweh is chosen, all right. And a lot of, a lot of these uh, individuals that come in this truth, they uh, um, they don't know how to apply basic scriptures. Okay. You know you gotta really, you know when you deal when you're dealing with brothers, you really gotta uh, uh, have it in your mind that you're not just dealing with a uh, normal man. This might possibly be a man of Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Okay. And whenever you, and whatever you do to to one of the, uh, these little ones, you did it to Yahweh Shai, okay? So if you did uh, something righteously to uh, a man of the Lord, you did something righteous to Yahweh Shai, basically, okay? But if you did something wicked to Yahweh, uh, to one of these uh, men, you, yeah, you're doing something wicked to Yahweh Shai. And that's something that we always have to uh, uh, think about, okay? And I'm gonna uh, get the scripture now. This is Matthew 18 and 1. It says at that time. It says, at the same time came the disciples unto Yahweh Shai, saying, Who is the greatest in the kingdom of heaven? And Yahweh Shai came, called a little child unto him, and set him in the midst of them, and said, Verily I say unto you, except ye be converted and become as little children, ye shall not enter into the kingdom of heaven. Whosoever therefore shall humble himself as this little child, the same is greatest in the kingdom of heaven. And the reason why Yahweh Shai uh, used the child as an example is because a child is very humble, meek, and very sorrowful when, when they uh, make mistakes, okay? And a child is, is, is always going to be more ready to hear and listen than to perform an action, okay? And that's how we got to be. We always got to be ready to hear, listen, and be in a humble mind state 24-7, okay, to the best of our ability. And uh, I'm going to keep reading verse 5. And whosoever shall receive... One such little child in my name receiveth me. Okay, so if we receive one of these little children, all right, we, we, we receive Yahweh Shai. All right, and those little children, is talking about the elect. All right, verse 6, But whosoever shall offend one of these little ones which believe in me, it were better for him that a millstone were hanged about his neck and that he were drowned in the depth of the sea. Okay, so if you offend one of, the, of Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai's chosen men, it's, be, it's better that... A man had a millstone hang about his neck and was thrown in the sea, okay? And that's a pretty harsh death. So you can only imagine the, uh, the uh, consequences and the uh, judgment that a man is going to get if he offend one of Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai's little ones, all right? They're going to be the ones that are being with many stripes, as it talks about in the book of Luke. And, and, and that's something that I personally don't want to experience. Okay, hey, but there are going to be people out there that do experience this because they have offended the little ones and they don't want to repent. Okay, but they're not meant to repent because you know what? They're not predestinated to be a part of the elect. Their lot was to offend one of the, the little ones, to be a, a, a wicked individual. But Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shah is going to give them great judgment. You know, it's going to be like how in Amos, how it says they might, uh, you know, run from a, a, a bear. And then, they, you know, they, they go into a house. Then there's a snake there. Then after that, they, you know, they run outside.
back outside, then there's a line after them. You know, there's going to be all these calamities that are going to fall upon them. They're going to, they might escape one judgment to get another judgment. To, to you know, to, to survive that, to get, to go to another judgment and then finally get ultimately destroyed, man. All right. The Lord, hey, he's the king of terrors, man. The Lord can do some very, very horrific things. All right. So that's why it's very important on how we treat one another. Okay. You always got to remember that. All right. And it's and it's really a foundation uh, aspect of this truth. But if you don't got it, you don't got it. All right. That's it, man. It is just to that point now, man, where it's, hey, if you don't have it, you don't have it. But those brothers who do have it, hey, man, make sure you always, you know, stay in the spirit and you always treat your brother in right. You always, you know, do things accordingly, all right, to this, you know, to uh, and do everything properly according to the scriptures. You know, and with that, I can just, you know, remember that, uh, you know, that, that, you know, treating your brother is very important in this. And with that, I'm going to give all praise and honor glory to Yahweh, Bashim, Yahweh, Shah. Double honors to the apostles and the elders at Great Millstone and salutations to Yahweh, Shalom.